Let's get a check of your, your forecast now. And Kaylee Dion, we've always known you're uh, kind of full of hot air, and today you're proving <laughs> it, right? Just kidding. That's I funny, kid. Patrick. That That's funny. Hey, all right. I, I, you know, we, I got you. I'm, I'm good. Uh, we are, we're not joking around with this segment, though, because I know probably you guys at home have maybe thought, okay, how does it work, a balloon being able to just float in the air? Okay, so I have my friend Heather Edvinson here. She is a Science City educator, and she's here just for us this morning to kind of explain to you the process of how it works. So I'm going to hand you the mic so that you can talk, because I'm going to be helping you demonstrate. So hot air balloons work on the principle of Charles' law, which is that a gas expands when it warms up. So we have here some nice cold balloons. They've been under ice. I'm going to give it to Kaylee, and she's going to stick it in my hot water. It's nice and soft and crinkly. And as she sticks it in and lets that hot water hold it in for a few seconds there, and you can even see it if you're watching carefully, starting to expand and press out. And when she's ready to pull it out, it's going to be nice and puffed and taut. Yeah. So just like on the hot air balloon, when they burn those great big burners, that heats up all the air inside the envelope and that gives them their lift because that gas expands and so it takes up, it's less dense and that causes the lift and they rise into the air. Awesome. Heather, thank you so much for joining us and showing us that. That's really important to know, especially if you're going to be watching these. And uh, if you missed it, we're going to go ahead and put this on our website a little bit later on so you can show it to your kids before you head out here later on. So the forecast really important for the Balloon Festival. So Jeff Penner's been in studio helping me out today, and he's going to give you the nuts and bolts of the forecast. Jeff, you got good news? I do. And Kayla, I can't believe Patrick said you're full of hot air. That's just, that's just not right. You're, you're the nicest Whatever. person on the planet. Yeah, I can't have to believe it. Uh